Paradise Unleashed Presents Yungtang Valley and Zero Point, located in North Sikkim, the largest district of the Indian state of Sikkim. Situated in North Sikkim, Yungtang Valley is a paradise on earth, which is full of natural wonders and picturesque beauty. It is home to a zillion flowers, spectacular mountains and a serene river. Its breathtaking and magical surroundings make it a must-visit place for every traveler. It sits at an elevation of 3,564 meters that is 11,693 feet above sea level and is at a distance of about 150 kilometers from the state capital Gangtok. There is no direct way of going to Yungtang Valley, one has to first go to the capital, Gangtok and get permission to go to the valley. This is due to its proximity with the Indochina border. The protected area permit to visit Yungtang can be taken from Gangtok Tourism Office. The best way to visit Yungtang is to travel to Lachung from Gangtok, which is about 125 kilometers, by a shared or personal vehicle and stay overnight. It is not feasible to travel to Yungtang directly from Gangtok in a day as the region is prone to fogs and becomes dark very early. From Lachung, the drive to Yungtang takes just around an hour and the road is lined with colorful blooming flowers, making for a soothing and spectacular ride. Yungtang Valley is extremely picturesque, with green slopes covered with trees, yaks grazing in the flower-spangled grassy plains below, and a river flowing right through the valley. The serene and tranquil air of the valley cannot be described in words. A single visit there can leave the visitor in an enchanted state for weeks. It also happens to be situated at what is called, the tree line, the altitude above which there are no trees. This makes the Yungtang Valley unique in that it has trees and rhododendrons, and yet abounds in tiny, low-growing Himalayan flowers. Yungtang Valley is popularly known as, Valley of Flowers and is home to the Singaba Rhododendron Sanctuary which has over 24 species of the rhododendron, the state flower. The flowering season is from late February to mid-June, when innumerable flowers bloom to carpet the valley in multicolored hues of rainbow. Rhododendrons are shrubs or trees, and different species of rhododendron cover different large stretches of the valley. You can see some great species such as Arboretum, Grande, Nivelle, the state flower etc. Other than rhododendrons, there are flowers such as iris, primulas, cobra lilies, louse warts, poppies etc. State Forest Department holds International Rhododendron Festival here annually between March to May during the peak flowering season. In spring, the valley looks like a collage of little forests of different colors. The flowering of rhododendrons is over by May end. During monsoons, Starting in June, the valley blooms with all kinds of tiny Himalayan flowers, like the primroses, sink falls, louse warts and cobra lilies. This is a much more enchanting scenario, but takes a keen viewer, with an eye for detail, to truly appreciate. Yamthang Valley remains closed for tourists between December and March due to the heavy snowfall in the region. A number of hot springs are scattered in the valley providing an unexpected opportunity to feel the warmth of the water, even in freezing temperature. Rich in sulfur, these springs are believed to have miraculous healing power. Apart from a cosmic green meadow, plush green forest abundant in pine and silver fir trees fills the area. On your way towards Yangtang Valley, you can see gushing waterfalls and streams along with a splendid view of peaks with Pohanri and Shindu Senpa. You must carry warm clothes in all seasons as Yamthang is located at a high altitude and it can be biting cold at any time. Also, carry medication for high altitude sickness. The tour is supposed to go further to a place called Zero Point also known as Yumisamdong. 
Zero Point Sikkim stands at an altitude of 15,300 feet above sea level is 23 kilometers from Yamthang Valley and is the last outpost of civilization. This is where the civilian road ends and you can't drive any further and hence the name is Zero Point. The beautiful confluence of three rivers, surrounding snow-clad mountains and marvelous scenic views, make Zero Point Sikkim, one of the best places to visit in India, you can also spot a yak in the snow. Zero Point hardly has any green stretches of land, except those that become visible when the snow melts. The drive from Yunthang Valley to Zero Point is through the curving mountains, amidst the rugged piece of land, of geographic region and could be a lifetime experience. While the road is quite treacherous, the rewards are awesome. All those people who love winters and fantasize spending time in the snow, Zero Point is the place for you. The sight of the snow-covered mountain ranges and rivers will remind you of the valleys of Switzerland. The Indo-Chinese border is a stone's throw away from Yun Samdong and tourists are not allowed to go any further beyond this point.